Yeah, hello and how are you? Hey friends, welcome to the Shen Show. I am your host, Shenandoah Briscoe, coming to you from right here in St. Charles, Missouri. That's right. Hey, this here is Wednesday, March the 20th, 2019, V-Blog number 2583. Got a happy birthday shout out going out to Patrick Kelly and Jerry Reiser. So, without further ado, here is a happy birthday shout out to the two of you. I said, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So, happy birthday, I'ma say. You know, Patrick and Jerry, you're starting a brand new year today. So, happy birthday to you today. I said, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So, happy birthday, I'ma say. You know, you're starting a brand new year today. So, happy birthday to you today. At me, me, more. You chat it, cha 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 Many, many, many more. All right, all right, all right. Got a happy friend anniversary shout out going out to Kimmy Kimbers Gibbon. That's a that's a Facebook friend anniversary to Kimmy Kimbers Gibbon. So happy friend anniversary to you, Kimmy. I'm glad you could be my Facebook friend. Wouldn't you like to be my neighbor? <laughs> Oh, it's fine being friends, though. We can be friends. You don't have to be my neighbor, but wouldn't you like to be my neighbor? Speaking of that, let's do some weather. Some local weather. Some St. Charles weather. How's that sound? All right, here we are with the St. Charles weather forecast. For the remainder of the day, partly cloudy, lows near 37 degrees Fahrenheit, winds west to northwest, at 10 to 15 miles per hour. By the way, welcome to the first day of spring. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Anyway, like I said, that was two. And that'll be throughout the evening. 10 to 15 miles per hour winds. And then, how about your Thursday, March 21st forecast? Intervals of clouds and sunshine. Highs around 52 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Thursday night, mostly clear skies, lows around 35 degrees Fahrenheit, with winds of west to northwest at a 5 to 10 miles per hour. Then on Friday, March 22nd, sunny skies, highs around 53 degrees Fahrenheit, winds north to northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Clear skies overnight, with temperatures around 32 degrees Fahrenheit, winds are going to be northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Then Saturday, March 23rd, sunshine in the morning, followed by cloudy skies during the afternoon. Highs around 56, winds southeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And then Saturday night, cloudy skies around 43 degrees, winds southeast 5 to 10 miles per hour. Sunday, March 24th, Considerably cloudiness, uh, occasionally rain showers in the afternoon. Highs around 61 degrees, winds south to southeast at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Chances of rain are 50%, so there you go. Bring a raincoat once again. And then uh, Sunday night, mostly cloudy with showers in and a few thunderstorms. Lows around 48 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds south to southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chances of rain are 50%. And then Monday, Monday, Monday. Monday, March 25th. Overcast, overcast skies with rain showers at times. Highs around 51 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds north to northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Chances of rain 50%. Showers in the evening, then partly cloudy overnight, with lows around 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds will be north to northeast at 10 to 15, 10 to 20 miles per hour. Chances of rain, 40%. Tuesday, March 26th, sunny skies, highs around 51 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds north at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Clearing skies overnight, lows around 32 degrees. Winds east at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And then Wednesday, March 27th, to wrap up our seven-day forecast, intervals of clouds and sunshine. Highs around 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds south at 
five to ten miles per hour. Sounds like the day of the month to get out. And then showers, partly cloudy in the evening, increasing clouds with periods of showers after midnight. Lows around 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds south at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chances of rain, 40%. And that wraps it up for our seven-day forecast. What was that song we were going to do? Oh, yeah. Theme song to Mr. Rogers' lyrics. Here we go. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? It's a neighborly day in this beauty wood. A neighborly day for a beauty. Would you be mine? Ooh, could you be mine? I have always wanted to have a neighbor just like you. I've always wanted to live in the neighborhood with you. So let me make the most of this beautiful day. And since we're together, we may as well say, Would you be mine? Could you be mine? Oh, won't you be my neighbor? Won't you please? Won't you please? Please won't you be my neighbor? Hi, television neighbors. I'm glad we're together again. There you go. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful bay in the bader did. Would you be mine? Mm. Song lyrics. I've got sunshine. That's the Temptations. My girl. I've got sunshine. On a cloudy day, when it's cold outside, I've got the month of May, I guess you'd say, what can make me feel this way is my girl, my girl, my girl, talking about my girl. I've got so much honey, the bees envy me. I've got a sweeter song than the birds in the trees. Well, I guess you'd say, oh, what can make me feel this way is my girl, my girl, my girl, talking about my girl, hey, 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 oh yeah. I don't need no money, fortune, nor fame. I've got all the riches, baby, one man can claim. Oh yes, I guess you'd say, oh what? Can make me feel this way is my girl, my girl, talking about my girl. I've got sunshine with my girl, talking about, talking about my girl. I've even got the month of May with my girl. My girl, oh, oh, yeah, she's all I can think, my girl, talking about my girl, talking about, talking about my girl, my girl, oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. All right, hey, let, we can top that one, can't we, folks? We've got one for you. Start notepad. My grill. My grill.
Okay. We'll just try this a different way. Hey now, where's that? It is here somewhere. It's not follow me. All right, it's got to be here somewhere. Do -do -do, there it is. Let's hope. Ah, there we go. I, I can't wait till this comes up because, well, folks, this here is a uh, barbecue season. When that comes up, that's when I'm going to get outside and I'm going to do some stuff. And I'm going to do something like this. I've got barbecue pork steaks. I'm cooking outdoors. And when it's nice outside, you can hear the flames roar. I guess you'd say, oh, what can let me cook this way is my grill, my grill, my grill. Talking about my grill there's so much aroma my neighbors envy me i've got a better recipe baby than the place down the street ooh, ah, ooh. i guess you'd say a oh, what can let me cook this way is my grill, my grill, my grill. Talking about my grill. I don't need a stove top, nor no oven door gonna clang. I've got all the best foods, baby, a one man can't claim. I guess you'd say, a what? Can let me cook this way is my grill, my grill, my grill. Talking about my grill. Oh, I've got a pan of baked beans I'm cooking outdoors on my grill. I've even got potatoes down in the coals on my grill talking about talking about my grill ooh, 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 ooh. talking about my grill my grill alright had to do it you know I can't refuse that when you got a song out there and you want to sing it and you've written it you may as well sing it don't you know Hallelujah. I got one that I wrote just not too long ago. It's a religious song, which is okay because by the looks of our time frame, by the time I get done with it, it'll be time to do our portion of the program called Our Daily Bread. So what I'm going to do is pull that one up and give it to you. It's by far the hardest thing I've ever done. To be so in love with you and his only son. Follow me where I go, what I do, and make it so. Make it part of you to be a part of me. Follow me up and down, all the way and all around. Check my hands and you'll see that it's still me. It's long been on my mind, you know it's not been a long, long time. I've tried to find a way that I can make you understand the way I feel about you and just how much you'll need me to be there when I can talk to you when there's no one else around. Follow me where I go. What I do and make it so. 
Make it part of you to be a part of me. Follow me up and down, all the way and all around. Check my hands and you'll see that it's still me. You see, I'd like to share my life with you and show you things I've seen. The place that I am going to because you've seen where I have been. The way I feel about you and just how much you need me to be there by your side. You'll never be alone. And all the time you're with me, we'll feel like we're right at home. Follow me where I go. What I do and make it so, make it part of you to be a part of me. Follow me up and down, all the way and all around. Check my hands and you'll see that it's still me. Follow me where I go, what I do and make it so. Make it part of you to be a part of me. Follow me up and down, all the way and all around. Check my hands and you'll see that it's still me. I said check my hands and you'll see that it's still me. Alrighty then. Oh my goodness, what have I done? Poor guy. To knock myself out of where I wanted to be. Yep, I sure did. Alright, today's Daily Bread is going to be From Wailing to Worship. Yes, that's right, From Wailing to Worship. And I'm going to be reading the scriptures, um, Psalm 31 through 12. And if you're keeping up with the Bible in a year, which I really hope that you are, you're going to be, uh, we, well, we, together, you and I, are going to be covering Joshua 4 through 6 and Luke 1, 1 through 20, especially if you're covering it with the Bible with Briscoe right there on YouTube or on my Facebook page of several pages, what that I control. But yeah, right there, is, if you're being able to read this, or if you're being able to watch this program right here, you'll be able to watch the uh, Bible with Briscoe and follow along in your Bible. Now, I do use the NIV, so um, you uh, if you don't have an NIV, you can use whatever you want, but the NIV is a you got slightly different language in it, not that much. I mean, it's okay. It's just a little bit more um, easier for me to understand. So English, the translation's not that far off from the uh, um, King James version. And uh, one of the researchers from my church, who is very, very into the Bible, has done. He, he actually speaks uh, all the languages, the Greek and all of that. So. He's, he's actually a rocket scientist. Anyway, he's done the research on the NIV version and says that it's comparable to the King James. So that's the reason I uh, am using that. Matter of fact, I got it whenever we were in study group, uh, Bible study with him. Uh, that's when I received my copy of the NIV. Anyway, um, so today, though, we're doing... Uh, from Wailing to Worship. And I'm going to read the first uh, paragraph of the uh, devotion today so that it might entice you to jump on in to OurDailyBread.org uh, or ODB.org and join the crowd. Make sure that people all around the world get a little taste of the scriptures each day. Kim being battled with breast cancer. Kim began battling breast cancer in 2013. For days after her treatment ended, doctors 
diagnosed her with a progressive lung disease and gave her three to five years to live. She grieved sobbingly, sobbing prayers as she processed her emotions before God for the first year. By the time I met Kim in 2015, she had surrendered her situation to him and radiated contagious joy and peace. Though some days are still hard, God continues to transform her heart, wrenching suffering into a beautiful testimony of hope-filled praises as she encourages others. And there you have it. That would be from wailing to worship. All right, here we go. Psalm 31, or actually 30, 1 through 12. Psalms are songs, and I guess I could sing it. I will exalt you, Lord, for you lifted me out of the depths and did not leave, let me my enemies gloat over me. Lord my God, I called you, called to you for help, and you healed me. You, Lord, brought me up from the realm of the dead. You spread me from he spared me from going down to the pit. Sing the praises of the Lord, you, you, his beautiful people. Praise his holy name. For his anger lasts only a moment, but his favor lasts a lifetime. Weeping may stay for the night, but rejoicing comes in the morning. When I felt secure, I said, I will never be shaken. Lord, when you favored me, you made my royal mountain stand firm. But when you hid your face, I was dismayed. To you, Lord, I called. To the Lord, I cried for mercy. What is gained if I am silenced? If I do go down to the pit, will the dust pray, praise you? Will it proclaim, proclaim your faithfulness? Hear, Lord, and be merciful to me. Lord, be my help. You turned my wailing into dance, into dancing. You removed my sackcloth and clothed me with joy, that my heart may sing your praises and not be silent. Lord, my God, I will praise you forever. And there you have it, Psalm 30. Uh, and that was all of them, 1 through 12. Psalm 30. All righty then, that looks like the end of that this here program. I'm gonna got one more song for you, and that song goes something like this: Well, goodbye, my friends. It's a time to go. I said goodbye, my friends. It's a time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must go. So goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. This here has been Shenandoah Briscoe saying hello and how are you? Thanks for tuning in to the Shen Show. And as always, you know God loves you and so do I. So be blessed in Jesus' name and come back and see me tomorrow because, well, I'll be here and I hope that you are too. <laughs>